1. Install GitHub CLI on Mac operating system, Windows or Linux. So I'm gonna grab this link here and I'm gonna look for, well, if you, if you have a Mac, you're gonna use this. If you have a Linux, you're gonna use this one. I have a Windows, so I'm gonna grab this command with, okay. Windows GH is available via Winget, Scoop, Chocolate, Kanda, and as downloadable MSI. So with Winget, I'm gonna go to my folder here. I have a folder. Uh, I'm gonna click right, right click, and I'm gonna open my terminal. You can do it from your get terminal if you want. So I'm gonna type in winget install hyphen well double hyphen id github.cli and then press enter okay so we wait for this installation let me see okay the application is licensed to you by its owner downloading okay let me make it a little bigger okay pro okay yeah successfully installed all right so what else they say okay if you want to upgrade it you have uh, wing it space upgrade space double hyphen id space get half that cli so here's a note the windows installer modifies your path when using windows terminal you will need to open a new windows for the changes to take effect simply opening a new tab will not be sufficient okay yeah so now in the command line enter g uh, gh auth login then follow the prompt so from here we're gonna just type in gh what else was gh space auth and then login and then we press enter okay what account do you want to log into so Okay, use arrows to move type type to filter github enterprise or github.com uh, We're using github.com only so we we'll press enter What is your preferred protocol for get operations? Uh, if if you want you can use the SSH. I'm gonna use the HTTPS the hypertext transfer protocol secure and for example you can use your the arrows and your and your and your machine and your laptop your computer to move up and down so and then you press enter i'm gonna choose https okay now authenticate with your github credentials it's asking you so uh, y uppercase uppercase letter y for yes and lowercase letter and for no so i'm gonna type yes okay login with a web browser paste an authentication token okay okay login with a web browser or paste an authentication token so we're gonna i'm gonna choose login with a web browser first copy your one time code okay this is my one time code here uh, press enter to open in your browser so okay all right so enter the code is placed on your device zero seven c e nine nine a f so let me see okay then congratulations you're all set your device is now connected okay good awesome